Pisces, a psycho. Hello, how are you today? I hope you're doing fine. Are you ready to learn science talk? Great! But before we start our lesson, I want you to prepare yourself as well as your materials necessary for your study. Try to find a nice and comfortable place inside your home where you can focus with your lesson. For this week's lesson, we're going to answer three questions. Number one, what are the different phases of menstrual cycle? Number two, describe the phases of menstrual cycle. And number three, how does menstrual cycle occur? What are the different phases of menstrual cycle? Study the illustrations below. Can you say something about it? So based on the pictures that we have, the menstrual cycle is a monthly occurrence in female and it has an average span of 28 days. It is a process that prepares women for pregnancy. Menarche is the first onset menstruation and menstruation also known as period refers to as female's monthly bleeding. What are the different phases of the menstrual cycle? The different phases of the menstrual cycle are menstrual phase, follicular phase, ovulation phase, and luteal phase. Can you give the four phases of the menstrual cycle? The different phases of the menstrual cycle are M stands for F stands for, O stands for, and L stands for. Describe the phases of the menstrual cycle. Menstrual phase. It is the breaking down of the lining of the uterus. It can last any time from 3 to 7 days. Follicular phase. It is the preparation of the ovaries to release an egg cell. It occurs from 5th to 13th day. Ovulation phase. It is the release of an egg cell. It occurs from 14th day of the cycle. Luteal phase. It is the changing of female hormone levels that causes the uterine lining to shed. It occurs from 15th to 18th day of the cycle. How does the menstrual cycle occur? The menstrual cycle includes several phases. The exact timing of the phases of the cycle is a little bit different for every woman and can change over time. Cycle days approximate events of menstrual cycle. Days 1 to 5. The first day of the menstrual bleeding is considered day 1 of the cycle. Your period can last anywhere from 3 to 8 days, but 5 days is average. Bleeding is usually heaviest on the first 2 days. Day 6 to 14. Once the bleeding stops, the uterine lining, also known as the endometrium, begins to prepare for the possibility of pregnancy. The uterine lining becomes thicker and enriched in blood and nutrients. Day 14 to 25. Somewhere around day 14, an egg is released from one of the ovaries and begins its journey down the fallopian tubes to the uterus. If sperm are present in the fallopian tube, at this time, fertilization can occur. In this case, the fertilized egg will travel to the uterus and attempt to implant in the uterine wall. Days 25 to 28. If the egg was not fertilized or implantation does not occur, Hormonal changes signal the uterus to prepare to shed 
its lining and the egg breaks down and is shed along with the lining. The cycle begins again on day 1, menstrual bleeding. I hope you learned a lot from our today's lesson. See you again in our next one. Bye!